I met another lawyer in Alcoholics Anonymous. But he said, you know, do you have a job? I said, you know, not in law, which is really what I'd like to be doing at this point. And he said, why don't you come meet my partners, come into my office. We can talk to you a little bit about what we do. I came here very protective over my past, my history, what I've been through. I didn't want to be, especially professionally, um, labeled as anything. So, number one, nobody thinks that that much of a big deal. You know, you think it's a much bigger deal than anybody else. I learned that. You know, to tell you the truth, and I work in a big firm, there was at least four to five people that I work with or see in my office on a daily basis that are in the program. And that was astonishing to me. The difference between me, I think, at 30, living with my parents and many people who um, are in the legal profession who struggle with alcoholism or substance abuse of some kind, is they've got children, they're married, they've got responsibilities bigger than that, and they don't have the time to go away. I was with many people who were professionals, and, uh, you know, I'm talking about lawyers, doctors, accountants, you name it who put their practices on hold. Today, I exercise routinely. I learned to meditate, which helped a lot with anxiety and fear and, and a lot of my emotions. I got married in sobriety. I had a beautiful baby in sobriety. We just got a puppy. You know, all these responsibilities I can handle. I think lawyer assistance is great for people in the legal profession, law students, lawyers, you name it, um, that really don't know how to take that next step and really just find out, you know, what are my options? Do I have a problem?